on this episode of Lapeef, let's talk. Cold water, and so you don't. You already said question. that, ma'am. Can I please finish my statement? I just want to know you don't have a job. Where do you stand, ma'am? Ma'am, can I finish my statement? This is like old times <laughs> answer. Ma'am, so no, it's not. Do you stay with your mama? Like, where do people with no jobs stay at? With you. <laughs> on your <laughs> kind of box. <laughs> <laughs> they call the homo, homosexual. Ain't they call that homosexual? That's a fact. No. Yeah. Why a you think the sex so good? Right there. See, right there. Why you there? think the sex uh-uh. so good? I'm looking for a place to stay. Kayla, would you that's, that's, that's no guy she talking about. Hypothetically. Kay or, Kay no. or already answered it. She oh, said she no. Oh, okay. Even my college no. boyfriend at 18 years old had a job. There Thank you, you for the hype, hypothetical you answer. I like to Listen, I just want to appreciate all three out of four <laughs> ladies on the panel for answering the question. Honestly, I love you guys. You guys are absolutely awesome. It doesn't does matter. matter. No, it does yes. matter. No, because the question probably is said, why are they men that only love for what they can provide? That's the question. Kayla that answered it because they have and one again, I qualified my provide. answer. <laughs> I qualified my answer in the very beginning. And if you want to rewind the tape, I said it again. It's a difference between lust and love. You can't lust tell somebody, you know, in that love somebody Anton. Love ain't gonna keep her. I mean that that. That ain't gonna, that lust ain't gonna keep her. That's go, that's gonna be temporary. Why are you assuming you it's lust? About, okay, it, get you in between her legs, whatever. Why are you the assuming that? Get you in between her legs. The that lust is not gonna keep her long term. I'm just telling you. Oh my goodness. Why are you assuming that? You think that about those men? Like, why are you assuming that? Why is that your direct like the thing that your mind immediately goes to? Why can't it just be that a woman might care about somebody or love someone who is not a financial provider or whatever to a certain extent? Like, why are you automatically saying, well, he must be doing this? Why are you even? Why is she? Why is she? But Kay, why is she doing that? Why is she doing that? I don't know. Ask them. But my thing is, I know and you know, Kayla, and we all have seen women who are in relationships that have women. Exactly. So I don't know why we're acting like this is not a thing well, that people I, do. But the women that they have are also broke. But it don't matter. It says why are men only love for what they can provide? It didn't say why do rich women what only I'm like, saying is most women women any of that. just want a man that has more than she has. Man. So no one thinks so that if you don't have anything matters, if you don't have anything and he works at said. McDonald's that's no one thinks that, that you know. the actual human matters. Like, am, is there anyone? Well, here, the- and and here's the thing, because I understand what you're trying to. Okay, I, I understand what you're trying to say, but let's just take that theory that the man don't have a job, but he's able to get women, and that woman is probably only with him for the majority of the time because either she can't get whom she wants. Or for validation, meaning she just wants someone there. But that's not love. That's just something of convenience because no one else is there. But I bet 20 on it that she's going to disrespect that man. Oh, uh, Jay, I'm telling you love. That, why she there is that Crimson really Cure comment there. was on point. Just because somebody is not providing money or whatever. I want her to, yeah, okay, but well, what is he providing then? I didn't see the comment. He's providing these. They are put it back up in the provide. But what like but it. like I said earlier, it depends sex? on the what individual else is he woman. Outside of it depends on no. sex. Yo, okay, it, would you talk to a man that don't have no, you rock with a man that ain't got a no job? It, it depends on the individual woman, not hey, all would you would you, not would you rock with a man that ain't got no job? It depends on the individual. Let me please finish what I'm saying. It depends on the individual. If a woman wants to, some women have enough money and they just want somebody to give them quality time. That could be it. Girl. Wait, hold on. Some women <laughs> don't necessarily you know quality time situation. Kind of women they might, but do you know out. these type of women, Kay? Have you, have you, do you oh know? Those, those, like, those, those, go, ahead. go ahead. Those women no, are I'm attractive asking. and can't get men. So they're getting whatever they can get. And he ain't got no until, job. It's okay, boo. I got a job. Until the I'm upgrade comes around. Hey, would you talk to a man without no job? In my experience, people with no jobs, um, men 
project their uh, things onto me. Like, I haven't dated a person with no job in. So is it a yes or a no? Though? I'm I'm just answering this question. Um, I haven't dated a person with no job. I don't think I have. No, but would you do it now? A hypothetical question. I didn't say have you. I said yeah. would you I've date never a dated person a person with no job. job. Yeah, I don't think I've ever dated. Never. Would no. you not even in college. Like, even no, I'm not listening. That's what I'm trying to think back to like undergrad. Like, Are y'all listening? He said, "Would you? Would you right now?" That's if, what he's asking. Not if you I can. am with a. Okay, yeah, if you were single, I'm hypothetically, not, would you? Would you I'm not date a hypothetical? Thank you. You so you are so. You be telling yeah. Anton even in college, even in college, you should have a job. They don't want to, but it's I will. Very, not, listen, listen, I, listen, listen. Like we all know that it's a very simple answer. The answer is no, and you don't want to disqualify your argument by answering it honestly. So you keep on deflecting Whatever around you, you know that everything fine. that you said don't Whatever really. Whatever you think is fine. It don't stand. It's okay. That's cool. Look, and, 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 Hey, listen, you are not a master debater. Just because you deflect does not mean that you are great at what it is that you're doing. Okay, that's the you thing. Not answering your opinion. You know that it's cap. And you know that if you answer it honestly, it disqualifies everything that you just said in order to How try to. How can I answer that honestly? Like, I can't even fathom. Like, I'm with my man. and It's a hypothetical, here. Kay. We all, all the men on the island. I'm talking to Anton. I mean, but so you're funny. not getting you know, you know, I'm, I'm just. You know what's so funny about it, Q? Is that. Kay has no problem Asking giving me a hypothetical question. And, and, and guess what? And guess what? You don't have to answer any of them. But guess and what? Over. We're not the same. If <sighs> any time I ask any of you a question that you don't want to answer or that you can't fathom hypothetically, feel free to say, no, I'm not going to answer that. That's up to you. Don't now tell me what I can do based on what you do. Okay. Kay, no, would so you hypothetically date a man with no job? Man, listen, and answer, if I ask you a question you don't want to answer? I'm making an assessment. And my assessment is that you know that your argument don't hold water. And so you don't you want to. You already said question. that. Ma'am, can I please finish my statement? I just want to know if you don't have a job. Where do you stand? Ma'am, ma'am, can I finish my statement? This is like old times <laughs> answer. Ma'am, so no, it's not. Do you stay with your mama? Like, where do people with no jobs stay at? With you. <laughs> on your couch. <laughs> <laughs> they call it homo, a homosexual. Ain't they call that homosexual? That's a fact. No. Homo That's yeah. a Why do you, you think the sex so good? Right there. See, right there. Why you think the sex so good? I'm working for a place to stay. You you have... Kayla, would you date a man with no That's the guy she's talking about. Hypothetically. Kay or, Kayla yeah. already answered it. She said oh, she no. Already answered? Oh, okay. Even my college no. boyfriend at 18 years old had a job. There Thank you, you for the high hypothetical answer. Job. I like Listen, I just want to appreciate all three out of four ladies on the panel for answering the question. Honestly, I love you guys. You guys are absolutely awesome.